is Tanya Bashan, and I'm the state coordinator for the Connecticut Tea Party Patriots. And right now we're going to one of uh, 20 weekly mini teas, as we call them, uh, where towns uh, throughout the state hold mini tea party rallies uh, at various intersections throughout uh, throughout the state, uh, just out there trying to keep the idea of the tea party and limited government and fiscal responsibility and the Constitution in the in the public's mind, trying to you know help them remember that they are the people that are in charge of this country and in charge of their own lives. Uh, and so we come out here as a crowd. <laughs> Chris from Stratford, and uh, I'm on my way to the local tea party here. And uh, basically, uh, we're looking for smaller government. Government just getting too big, taking control of everything, and uh, it's got to stop. Uh, how long have you been involved in uh, in protesting out on the street here? Uh, it's last summer, sometime. Started up, and uh, been out here every weekend. Took a break during the winter time, and uh, I learned that every Thursday we're out here. Hi, my name is Nikki. I live in Shelton, Connecticut. I have uh, been about almost a year now. I belong to the 912ers of Southern Connecticut. There's a website if you're interested. We uh, get together. We get together to uh, bring our concerns about the government and where it's going, and the spending, and the future for my kids, my grandkids. The uh, reason I'm here tonight is to let people in traffic sitting here, working hard, paying taxes, know that they do have alternatives. There are ways to approach in a very peaceful and kind and conservative way to let the government know we are not happy, they're not listening, and elections are very soon coming. Have you always been interested in politics? Never. What? What? what uh, Never. <laughs> what, what, what got you started? Um, I I began listening to what was happening, and I began realizing that politicians that have been in office too long, or who have agendas, thank you, who have agendas to change this country. Uh, they're in office and, and they're not listening to us and they're making me very unhappy. My sofa got very uncomfortable, so I'm out on the streets, right? Hi, my name's Cheryl. Um, I've been doing this tea party on this corner for about a year and a half. We got involved when government started getting too big and taxes started getting too high and and uh, decided it was time to wake up and fight for our country. We stand out here every week hoping to wake up other people that think like us and um, God bless America. Yeah, my name's Howard. I've been a part of the Tea Party since its inception. Uh, I'm going to be starting a group myself. And uh, I'm, I'm out here today because I'm sick and tired of being railroaded by politicians. It's supposed to be a representative republic, and it's turned into a dictatorship. And when I say that, I don't say it as a Republican or an independent or a Democrat. Because as far as I'm concerned, they're all the same. It's like there's a kid possibly can that I'm out here. I stand for freedom, man. The government should not be telling you what to do. You should be telling the government what you need. They shouldn't be forcing things down your throat, giving you higher taxes, bad health care. That's just a bad deal all the way around. You should have to take over your lives and tell you what to do. in common with each other other than being here. Um, can you talk a little bit about that? Well, the group, we have lots of different groups. We have uh, the Second Amendment advocates, the illegal immigration uh, crew. We have the, uh, the gun groups. We have the family values or social values groups. And we have everybody together because the one thing that we all can agree on is that the federal government is too big and too intrusive and we want to be left alone. Uh, so whether you're a states' rights person or a, a immigration is your thing or education is your thing or, or gun rights are your thing, whatever your thing is, we can all agree that the government is too big and too intrusive, spending too much of our money and uh, curbing too many of our freedoms. 
And uh, so that's what we all call us around, and it, it, it seems to work. Some mixed reactions out here. I mean, uh, we get a lot of support, as you can see. Uh, we're getting a lot of horns blowing, and most of the people are very supportive. And occasionally, you get a person giving the uh, one finger salute or yelling some obscene things. But is, is that the thumb or the other finger? Yeah, that would be the other th finger. Most people, people out here are supportive for the most part. Especially since the health care passed, we've been getting a lot more thumbs up than uh, one finger salutes, and it's great to see that people are actually waking up. So a guy called me on the Monday after the health care bill passed, 7 a.m. in the morning, and said, I own a sign and banner company, so what can I do to help? And he ended up making and designing all of our lawn signs, and he did produce all of our banners for the New Haven Tax Day Tea Party Rally. Because he was, had never been involved before. But he was pissed off. How you doing? I bring the rainbow, Jerry and I bring all. Congress, all about what you guys are all about. How you doing? Hey, hey, hey. Congress over there. Okay, do you guys have your